Welcome to Noble Things of Wisdom with Pastor Bimbo Akinjokun. Be blessed as you listen. Good morning, my dear friends. Thank you for tuning in and making our time to listen to this message. It is my prayer that the Almighty God will richly bless you and that your life will never remain the same in the name of Jesus Christ. Have you noticed that the largest animals on earth and even in the sea are not the ones that prey on other animals? The largest sea animal is the blue whale and it weighs as much as 200 tons. It does not feed on other fishes. It only feeds on plankton, majorly creels. In fact, its throat, in spite of its size, is so small that it cannot swallow anything bigger than a beach ball. The largest animal on land is the African elephant. It did not get that reputation by feeding on other animals. The African elephant feeds predominantly on grass. You do not have to prey on others for you to be great in life. You do not have to destroy other people's lives for you to amount onto something on somebody in life. There are a lot of people who believe that the only way they can go up is by bringing others down. They believe that the only way things can go well in their lives is when things go wrong for others. That is not the ultimate plan of our Heavenly Father. You can reach the peak of your ability in life without destroying other people's lives. In fact, the greatest men on earth are those who meet the needs of others, not those who prey on the life of others. I'm asking you today to learn from the blue whale and from the African elephant. Instead of preying on others, tearing others down so that you can go up, make up your mind to focus all of your energy towards the betterment of the life of others. Jesus Christ, the greatest man that ever walked the face of this planet, bettered the life of others. The richest men are not those who are destroying other people's businesses. They are those who are enhancing other people's businesses. God wants you to reach the peak of your abilities but not by you praying on the life of others. Go into this week. Make bold moves towards the fulfillment of your destiny and God will release all the grace and the favor that you need to make it happen unto you. God bless you and have a fruitful week. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You have just listened to Noble Things of Wisdom with Pastor Bimbo Akinjoko. This conversation continues on Facebook and Twitter. Simply like Bimbo R. Akinjoko on Facebook or follow at Bimbo Akinjoko on Twitter. For questions and comments, please call 0809-533-8612 or 0805-901-0005. Remember to tune in next time. God bless you. This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Hill City Inspiration House. 